Masasela, everybody knows Hore Omosimana Pitori or Hore Tego Pitor. Growing up in Pitori back then, how was it? What was the experience like? Growing up in Pitori and Mamelodi, it was always great for me, mm. you know. I grew up being this uh, happy kid, you know. But of course, not uh, knowing that there was also another evil monster mm. of a thing that was really behind. Yes. or in front that I will sort of like really witness in some way and understand mm. which was the apartheid. Yes. But only it came, you know, uh, to be visible through the steps that I was sort of like really going forth yes. uh, as I was uh, witnessing, you know, during the time when I was growing up at my grandmother's place because there used to come quite a lot of characters there. Okay. Uh, because my grandmother was a Shebin queen and was the first Shebin queen in Mamelodi. Really? Yes. <laughs> she started the trend. Yeah, yeah. That's right. She was the first Shebin queen in Mamelodi. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm so happy because uh, with that, she sort of like really endorsed the uh, township economy. You okay. Know? Yeah. Is that where the, your music was, where I started incubating as well? inside that Shebin or...? As I, as I looked at that, there was quite a lot of other characters coming there. Uh, political meetings were also held, okay. you know, at the Shebin. And then also music played quite a lot of important role. So there was quite a lot of variety of styles of music that was played through vinyls, you yeah, know, oh, albums, yeah. yes, the 45 and all. Yeah, yeah, the variety of styles of Kuela, Marabi, Bakanga, Mbube, and the Malombo music of Dr. Philip Taban. Dr. Philip Taban. Yeah, so the Dark City sisters were like, yeah, Bo, Bo Sesi Hill, Dad, Obata, Mahotela Queens, and then Bo. Wow. Yeah. And know? these are all the people that, were you aware at that time that these people, or is it only later that you became subsequently aware of their importance to our industry and to the whole landscape of South African music? Look, uh, because the music was like really there and I was listening to it whatever, and I love it. And then visibly also there will come also these men who will sing, you know, yeah. and this kind of an a cappella range um, of uh, voices, typical like Lady Smith, Black Mambazo, yeah. and doing the scatamia dancing, simultaneous beating of the legs. Yes. It was really great at the backyard of the Shebin. And yeah. the men also coming with an acoustic guitar called Shebeleza. Yeah. And that's when I know I loved, you know, watching that, you know. And that's when you know, my, 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 my music, my, that's when I started to be in love with music.